Summer has come and gone. The switch has been flipped. The beginning of fall camp started tonight as of 7.25 p.m. and the Vols are finally back together for the first time here on Haslam Field. Well, I thought we had good energy. I thought the pace was good for a first day, but not up to our standard and expectations. We need to continue to progress and get better with that. But, uh, you know, sometimes your energy, you don't feel it as much because there's so much thinking going on. And so our young players are trying to really absorb everything. I thought our older players did a really good job of really taking spring practice and having now a year under their belt, kind of leading them today and also coaching them as well. Junior center Matt Crowder says that until the pads go on, the team will be focused on continued learning of the playbook. Today was just a good day to get us started off. Um, more of a mental day than anything. Uh, it's, it's a little bit different without pads on, so it's just coming out here, kind of getting the feel for things and working on uh, the mental aspect of it, getting our tempo going. Senior defensive lineman Jordan Williams says that excellence in summer workouts directly relates to the pace and rhythm of fall camp. I was actually real surprised with as many freshmen as we had. They really kept up with the pace because I think, I think it, it comes from our off-season lifting program and how, how we have fast pace there, and it just, it just carried on out here. That's it for practice number one here in Knoxville, and football is definitely in the air for Team 118. Today, the Vols learn the rhythm of practice, but that's only the start. Join me right here on UTSports.com tomorrow for practice number two. For Vol Report, I'm Sarah Mitchell.